The House of Representatives has questioned the power sector over continuous grid collapse in the country. The committee said since the privatization of the power sector in 2013, Nigeria has witnessed over 100 national grid collapses. However, Minister of State for Power, Gudi Agba, who appeared before the committee dismissed the report of the lawmakers saying Nigeria has not experienced national grid collapse but systems disruption. We are not here to find faults. We are here to find solutions. <coughs> we understand the image of the problems. And we are here to give the required legal backing and assurances of funding to this sector. So we expect to hear the truth, nothing but the truth, from you. But blackouts can result from collapse as well as disruption. But this one we have had this year. We've had four of them, but they have not been collapse is disruption. And disruptions have been as a result of, there could be human factors, there could be uh, implement, equipment factors, there could be um, political factors, there could be other factors. For instance, sometime last month we had a blackout for a short while. It was due to, and we saw on social media, young men switching off um, the, 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 the system. That's not the collapse. That's deliberate vandalization. That, the, the, it's, in fact, it's sabotage. If you ask my opinion, it's sabotage. How can young men go and switch off? Putting the nation in blackout. TCN we have a capacity of 8,100 megawatts. At the highest we transmitted was on first March last year, where we, 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 we transmitted 5,801 megawatts. And we have always made this point. There is no day when generation company will say we have generated so much megawatts and TCN is unable uh, to evacuate it. There is no that and we are still challenging all generation companies to come out if there is any day they make a generation where we cannot evacuate it. The committee on power pursuant to a motion in the house has conveyed this investigative hearing to examine the causes of the repeated collapse of the national grid and the nationwide blackouts resulting from these incessant collapses. Following this hearing and other engagements with the industry operators, regulators, and varied stakeholders, the committee will make recommendations to the House of Representatives on legislative and other interventions to prevent future occurrence, reoccurrence. This is an important assignment.